All right, and here we have another MacBook. We are going to open the bottom of this MacBook and see what it looks like on the inside. And look, oh boy, this MacBook gives me lots of hope and happiness. There's a screw just sitting over here. Great job. That screw belongs in the fan over here, and it's just chilling. Oh, Jesus. Okay. First thing to do is put that screw back where it belongs, inside its fan. Okay, screen doesn't turn on. All right, let's take a look at what's going on there. First thing for we do is check to see what the resistance to ground is. 24 ohms. That's no good. So now we unplug the screen, and the resistance to ground is actually still rather low. That's no good. All right, so there's definitely an issue with the screen, but there's also an issue regardless of the screen. So we're going to take this board out of the case because we that resistance to ground on backlight is way too low. We, yeah, still 274 ohms. So let's look at everything that's involved in the backlight circuit. Now, I'm going to start with the LCD connector. The reason I'm going to start with the LCD connector is because when I unplug the screen, there is a change in the, in the resistance. It goes to down to 27 ohms. So the LCD cable is probably burned. And what I'm guessing is that when the LCD cable burned, it may have burned something inside the LCD con the connector as well, and that's what could be causing my issues. So let's take a look over here. Doesn't look too terrible, but still, I'm probably just going to remove that. All right, so let's get my uh, hot air here. I'm I'm sick too, Douglas. No fun. Okay. All right. So we've removed the LCD connector. So it seems that we have 165 kilo ohms to ground here, which means that there was some sort of short inside the LCD connector. So, yeah, we went from 300 ohms to 166,000 ohms. So we, we have made some progress. Now we have to get ready to solder a new LCD connector there as well. Okay, that could use a little bit of cleaning now with a Q-tip and some alcohol. Let's go for it. Cleaning stuff is so satisfying. Instantly clean and evaporates in a cool way. Yep, I love 99% alcohol for that. Hmm. All right, so we've got our nice, happy new connector.
Make sure this thing is pushed down nicely. Damn, didn't have enough solder on my tip. Made a bigger glob on my tip. This time. It's not going to work properly if you have a tiny glob on your tip. I used way too big a glob here. That was dumb. How many years will it take Lewis to learn how to properly solder a damn LCD connector? Medvanlig Halsning. Alright, now let's see if this thing works. Medvanlig Halsning. I'm learning new languages. Let's see if we get a light on the screen. Alright, let's see if we get a light. Forty six point five volts. That is a light. Huzzah. So this definitely needs a new LCD cable and also an ultrasonic cleaning. But that is that. This MacBook appears to be fixed.